Hello friends, it's Sarah from Sweet Sense from the Dollhouse. I am bringing you Fender Wax. I am so excited. I know, you've seen like five of these videos so far, but I literally kid you not, there's like a hundred pounds of wax to go through. So I'm cutting them down by vendor. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, as always, welcome back. Hope you stick around. Um, so recently I picked up a multi-vendor D stash. This isn't just one. This is like accumulation of multi-vendor D stashes as well as I placed an order with Super Tarts and Barrett's Wax Crafts. Um, so my wax wife, Rhonda from Portland, Oregon, she is, she is a doll. Like she has given me so much stuff. It is just crazy because I told her up here in Canada, it's absolutely so hard to get my hands on this stuff. Um, I'm not sure that I will be keeping all of this. Like no one person needs this much wax. I have more wax than a person normally accumulates in five years on my bed right now. So <laughs> a lot of this will be on the Canadian D stash page just because it's an obscene amount of wax. So anyhow, let's get into it. Um, I'm also doing vlogmas. So this is my video entry for vlogmas today. Um, my previous ones that like I've vintage chic scents I was super excited about. So that was like definitely a Christmas present to me from Rhonda. Thank you. You are amazing. I know that I requested a couple of those vintage chic scents, but holy Hannah, like this girl is insane. Um, and she has spoiled me rotten with my very favorite vendor of all time so far is Southbound Soap Company. I love these people. I have only had the pleasure of trying four or five of their fragrances so far. And this entire box is full of Southbound Soap Company. So let's just dig in. The first one she sent me were two little flower shapes here of Caramel Cookie Latte. This is Caramel Drop Cookies and Rich Caramel Coffee. The pour date on this was August 2017, so these are definitely cured and ready to go. The only, like, criticism that I could say about Southbound Soap Company is that they sell these six packs, so once upon a time there were six tarts in here. Um, and then they have these sticky poly bags which the sticky lasts a very long time but they're just not my favorite like they don't seal entirely they're a bit messy oh, yep and in typical southbound soap company like wow wow I smell caramel cookies and coffee for sure that is amazing That is going to be my Monday morning melt tomorrow. Holy. That is gorgeous. Love that. The next one is Southbound Soaps Vintage Christmas. So these are cute, super cute little gingerbread men. Again with the glitter. I'm going to make a video on why we should avoid glitter people. Sorry, my gnarly nails need to be repainted. Oh, that's nice. It's ribbon candy, spiced tea, a hint of cinnamon, and a flower shop at Christmas. Oh, like all things Christmas in this melt. Man, oh man, that's beautiful. Wow. Love that. Thank you, Rhonda. The next one is a little tart of Southbound Soap's Cotton Candy Mandarin, which is mandarin orange, vanilla, and sweet cotton candy sugar crystals. 
This is from May of 2017, so plenty cured, ready to go. Mm. Actually, Sensi has something similar to this. Not sure which one, but hmm, this one might be a potential candidate for Wax Wars. That one's really nice. It's like not that the title is the same or like the name is the same as Sensi. Oh man, that's really familiar. I need to go through my spring and summer catalog for Sensi and figure out what that reminds me of. That one's really nice. And see, like she just sends me these little chunks just of things to try. Um, this isn't available on the website right now, but it will probably be back in the spring and summer or something like it. And then, you know, if you try it, then you'd know whether or not you want to actually purchase it. So the next one is Marshmallow Jam Cookies. And this was a bakery bag. She just sent me. It smells so good. I have tried these before in my very first um, vendor wax D stash. Look at that, like a little donut. So cute. So marshmallow. Oh yeah, jam cookies is marshmallow cream, super sugar cookies, and sweet berry jam drizzled on top. Uh, July 2017. This was actually the very first. Southbound Soap fragrance I tried and I was like instantly fell in love. I also warmed it in my Scentsy warmer and at the time I didn't realize Scentsy wasn't strong enough to melt Vendor Wax. I mean you can but Vendor Wax does much better in really 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 like the hot dangerous kind of element warmers so I have since purchased several of those to be able to melt my vendor wax in. And I keep my Scentsy warmers strictly for Scentsy. So, yeah, this is the fragrance that made me fall in love with this company. So it's nice to have two of those. I will probably hoard that until I see it come out again on their website. Um, it's just something I just don't want to be without. So the next one is one of these little pies. It's strawberry cookie milk. Fresh picked strawberries, freshly baked sugar cookies, and sweet caramelized sugar milk. Um, if you watch my very first wax cutting video, I cut up a couple of these. Oh, yeah. That's sugar milk, cookies, and strawberry for sure. Oh. Southbound soap is nothing like Scentsy. Like, Scentsy is kind of its own, very own entity, right? But you know how Scentsy does, like, totally authentic scents? Southbound Soap Company does the same. Southbound Soap Company also keeps it very, like, simple. So they come out with authentic fragrances. And they do blend, but they're very simple blends. If you want to blend them with something else and make them a more complex blend, have at her. But I love them for the authenticity and the simplisticness of the products that they put out. Love it, love it, love it. Super stoked about that. I got another one. So this is Southbound Soap's Berry Buttercream Waffle Cone. Fresh berries, whipped buttercream powdered sugar, flaky pastry puffs, and vanilla waffle cone. This one again is May of this year, so ready to go. I will definitely save the strawberry one for summertime. Oh, deadly. This one is definitely going to be a summertime melt as well. Oh man, the um, recipients of my December advent calendars, I made advent calendars for three of my subscribers. Um, two received it as a return random act of kindness and one of them won it for um, being entered into a draw on my channel. So those lovely ladies are 
enjoying their Christmas advent calendars. I have so much wax. I, I need to do more random act of kindnesses and share this. Like, I'm absolutely blessed to have found Rhonda and I need to pay it forward in some way, shape, or form. So, to the three lovely ladies who are enjoying those advent calendars right now, I hope you love them and I'm going to do more of them because I have more wax than 10 people need, honestly. Um, <clears throat> so the next one is this cute little like bunt cake. This one is pink serendipity lemon cake, which is pink sugar, serendipity, and sweet lemon pound cake. I'll show you this adorable little bunt. Not typically a serendipity fan. Like, I don't hate it, but it's just not my favorite. Look how cute that is. Actually, this one is really nice. Of course, Southbound would be the one to change my mind about serendipity. I like this. I really don't know what to melt in the summertime because I'm not really a huge berry or floral fan. So I find that difficult with Scentsy in the summer. I did find some really good ones this year that I liked, but <clears throat> with Fender Wax this year, I'll be melting tons of lemon cake, tea and cakes. Um, there's some really good spring and summer bakery scents in the Fender Wax world. So I will definitely be saving this for the summertime as well. Ooh, the next one is Southbound Soap's Pink Sugared Cinnamon Donuts, which is pink sugar, fresh crushed cinnamon bark, baked yellow cake with notes of creamy, buttery vanilla. And this one is from July of this year. I think with those kind of notes, you could warm this year round. Um, it's just bakery cinnamon. Pink sugar is kind of summery, but... Oh. Oh, I wish you guys could smell this right now. Look at how cute that is. A little pie with a donut on top. Oh, this is deadly. I, You will not see any of the Southbound Soap Company stuff in the Canadian D stash. This is all for me. I won't be sharing any of this. Unless maybe you win my next random act of kindness. I need to figure out an oh because I have a Sensi sampler giveaway coming up. Oh, lots and lots of good stuff on this channel, so stay tuned. So yes, pink sugared cinnamon donuts by Southbound Soap Company. Love it. Oh my goodness, these are adorable. Are you seriously I'm gonna fly to Portland and squeeze the shit out of Rhonda? So this is called Southbound Soap's Pink Seaside Cotton. It's pink sugar, fresh ozone, clean cotton, sheer musk, and amber. I know I'm going to love it already. It's an adorable little pie, and it has the cutest seashells on top. How cute is that? Oh, goodness, yeah. That's amazing. Marissa, you would love this, girl. That is deadly. Pink seaside cotton, pink sugar, fresh ozone, clean cotton, sheer musk, and amber. I love South Brown Soap Company. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm super happy that I've tried numerous other vendors, but South Brown Soap Company so far is still hands down my favorite. And I still have lots more in this bag or in this box. So the next one is gingerbread cake pops. Spicy gingerbread blended with sweet sprinkled cake pops. This one was actually uh, just poured in October of this year. Ooh, those are nice. And come on, come on, look at that. This is nice. It's a spicy ginger bread. Um, 
with the bakery note, but no frosting. And I, I kind of like that. You know, sometimes I do like the frosting and the vanilla and sugar and stuff, but sometimes it's just nice to have a simple bakery note that's not too sugary. And look at this. This is like pretty much full chunk bag. She is way too good to me. Unbelievably good to me. Gingerbread cake pops is really nice if you like bakery and not too like sickeningly sweet. Next one is strawberry zucchini cupcake. I told her that I was loving zucchini and I think she just literally gave me her entire zucchini stash. So this is freshly picked strawberries, zucchini bread, and buttercream cupcakes. This is from August of this year and another pretty much full chunk bag. Oh, this is deadly. So good. And they have the cutest little shapes, like look at that little cupcake. What else is in here? Cutest little piece of pie. Oh, this is deadly. Strawberry and just amazing zucchini bread. Oh, and yeah, I definitely the the buttercream is definitely just a hint of the buttercream cupcakes. Ella is out there going crazy with her big sisters. Nutballs. They're being total nutballs out there. Next one is marshmallow bunnies, which is sweet, creamy, whipped marshmallow cream and marshmallow fluff crispy treats with sugar crystals. This one is from March 30th, 2017. So I've heard about like Rice crispy home fragrance. I've, I've yet to smell it. So here it goes. I didn't even know that that was a thing. Like how can you make wax smell like Rice crispy treats? Oh my goodness, they can. I'm starting to wonder if they can. Oh my goodness. So these ones must have been like just in time for Easter. They're really cute little bunnies. And Easter egg tarts. That's exactly what it smells like. It smells like Rice Krispie Treats. Just marshmallows, sugar, Rice Krispie treats. Smells so good, you might want to eat it. Delicious. I have so much Southbound Soap Company now. I'm so stoked. Next one is Southbound Soap's Super Sugar Cookie, which is freshly baked sugar cookies with sweet vanilla. I might have to have a sugar cookie wax floors episode. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Actually, I have one of these. Rhonda sent me an ice cream cone in my very first um, multi-vendor de-stash, just like this, as a sample. And now she sent me the rest of the whole bag. Girl, you are nuts. Look at this cookie. Ice cream cones. What else is in here? Little cinnamon rolls. This is amazing. And much like um, I use Sensi's sugar cookie as a blending, like I, you can warm just straight sugar cookie, I'm sure, but um, I also use it as a mixer. Super sugar cookie. Oh, you have no idea how good this is. I'm in love. Merry Christmas to me. I don't care. I don't need any gifts. This, you should see this bed. I'm going to take a picture and put it in one of my thumbnails. It is insane. This is my Christmas present. Merry Christmas to the dollhouse. It's going to smell fantastic for 75,000 years. Thanks to Rhonda in Portland, Oregon. 
Not done yet. Next one is Southbound Soap's Heart Shaped Cookies. This is Pink Sugar, Marshmallow, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Frosted Sugar Cookie. This is from July 2017. Oh, yeah. Very similar to that, but this has pink sugar in it. Oh, my goodness, woman. This is like a full bag. And look at these shapes. Like, cutest hearts. Little hearts. Check that out. How fun is that? A bag of hearts. That's what it's called. Heart-shaped cookies. Pink sugar, marshmallow, vanilla bean noel, and frosted sugar cookie. Delicious. And this is literally a full bag of Southbound Soap. This girl is a nutcase. I'm running out of room here. Last but not least, I'm so excited about this. This is Southbound Soap's Carnival Time. I am loving the carnival scents like Circus Concessions. Um, so the scent notes for this one are sweet cotton candy, caramel apples, blue raspberry snow cones, and fresh funnel, fresh funnel cake. So basically everything that you can find at like circus or a fair. I have Make Sense Candle Company's version of Circus Concessions, and this is Southbound Soap Company's spin on the same sort of fragrance. And how fun are these? So we've got the smiley face tart, little stars. Look at these popsicles. Like, how fun is that? I definitely smell the caramel apples, the blue raspberry snow cones. I don't know about cotton candy. Like, I'm starting to wonder, until I have just a straight cotton candy, I think it's very much like vanilla bean noel. It's like a blending scent, right? You don't necessarily get it on top note, but... Oh, and there's blue ones in here, too. Oh, my goodness. How cute is this? So... This one was the one I was looking most forward to, and I don't know. To be honest, I'm not too sure about this one quite yet. I need to warm this, and I will do a review on all of these. Stay tuned. Um, I might also save this. Like, I find the circus concession, the carnival time, like, I find that those are better scents for, like, late August, early September. It's a great transition scent. Um when you're done with the summer stuff but not quite ready for the fall and winter stuff so uh, you might not see them in my melting basket anytime soon but they're not going anywhere I can assure you that I'm definitely not de-stashing them so and then she sends these cute little notepad clip with pens there was a bunch of candy in here uh, these are going to be for Gracie this little book that says believe in yourself Aww. and it has like the most adorable quotes in it like just inspirational quotes it says let your dreams be your north star should you meet the resistance take comfort it's a great way to build muscle like where do you find people like this Honestly, I absolutely love, love, love this woman. It's going to be like my mission to get my ass to Oregon and squeeze her to pieces. Anyhow, I still have lots more vendors to cover and I have no idea where I'm going to sleep. I might very well get naked and do snow angels in this wax, but I won't put that on the video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, smash the bell for future content notifications and potentially naked snow angels. Bye for now.